what is up y'all it is me tasha c and in this particular video is part two of ggg's reaction this time you y'all is actually um to your rage which is the second part by the way i'm posting this in uh, any video that i'm doing october i keep forgetting to, uh, to put this in here you know it's breast cancer awareness month of cancer and also dv uh, domestic v um awareness month but anyway y'all um in my last video i really was you know posting and in between putting information about you know why i kind of included ddg's reaction and his reaction which he's been off of twitch for a while and i guess he came back because you know like i said a lot of people say ddg was right about bruce drop him off i have still two more videos to do about this spot which i put right in my damn pl pl playlist that i made now called bruce dropping off my youtube youtube page has uh, ctv and then i'm out but uh you know then this would be the end of this mini mini series okay as far as i'm concerned but um other than that y'all i will be also putting some stuff in there because there is going to be a thing to your rate uh, um that uh dg mentioned about your rage i said before that you know obviously like ddg knows both your rage and, and you know amp uh whatever or you know like i say uh kai, like i said kai cement and your rage and bruce dropping off was like in this trio for a while or you think like a group of friends i don't i don't even know friends long with originally with Bruce dropping off or used to be friends with them, whatever just like Cosnet was but you know they want to have a good friend and all this shit in the past seemed like on and off for months has been messed up and and then you know too um both of them were trying to like uh, what are we getting uh, uh this, this spring 2023 or something months ago trying to set up where um, at least DG, uh, G, G and Bruce dropping off can, you know, stop this, uh, B thing, which, um, didn't go too well. Then they seem like that, they peace. Then Bruce dropping off, off like, you know, almost like, uh, Kaisman and, um, and I think Yo Rage was taking the side. And DG thought he was advertised by three people, stuff like that. And then I put it in between when he's talking about it, like, you know like how your rage call I'm like man we got a problem we can talk whatever and this last thing i checked or known about it they had stopped so let me stop you know uh talking or the word i found out recently was japan and let's go straight into ddg's response reaction to the Bruce dropping off situation um leaked messages and shit right now all right This is a this is like off topic. If y'all been in my streams, but I heard my my dog Tommy G going crazy, man. Clap it up for Tommy G. Tommy G is the number one YouTuber to me, bro. He got the best content, bro. It's crazy. Finally, he getting his flowers. I think Tommy G going dummy. I've been watching his videos, but let me see. Hold on. Like, how does this happen during the same time? I Literally, my last tweet I just deleted because it was a go live tweet was me, Con Bruce, and sh listen. I like this video already. He censored. Yeah, PG 13. Green marks. Bruce got exposed. Bro. Bruce dropped him off for some reason, trusted his mods. Nick D never met in his life with like pillow talk you know what i'm saying I, I don't know why i don't know i don't know why my never met these in their life like i don't condone no leaking shit, but what the f did you expect that shit was just bound to happen man i ain't gonna talk about the cash i ain't gonna talk about the amp i ain't gonna talk about the yachty i ain't gonna talk about no 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 k sign wait hold on he this yachty too what yachty do well, DDG and the rest of us that may be wondering now, the possibility, the reason why he has problems with your little Yachty is for one thing, based on possibly a beanie 
and he was saying like you know you must tell you gave some ration he had a beanie on and the next day bruce dropped him off or after he wore it had wore this beanie and so those text messages were leaked as well you know you my son now and then also to add on is that you little yachty has a um a uh you know, a podcast i think now too and around this time like late july 2023 i mean it's still the same year and around this time i also have found out that um you know they he had kai Sinan, and it was after like you know this drama i think around the time with the dg incident before or after i ain't gonna lie that i don't specifically really know what the exact time but you know he brought bruce uh, drop him off and said like he need to apologize stuff like that you know <laughs> to this as well and talking about we jumped in the room what well, y'all look at the equipment stuff and bruce dro um drop him off responded to it so let, let's listen and hear you know um you both you a lot of um you know response but at the same time bruce dropping off uh reacting to it i bet you haven't spoken to I haven't spoken to Bruce. I haven't spoken to Bruce. Bruce, I don't know where you at, but we know you're watching. He's probably drunk in that little room with some skateboards on the wall. You need to call Kai. You need to apologize. Right? Yo, I hate you this. More, man. Yo. <laughs> Yo, Chad, why why everybody why everybody just try to put on me like I'm a drunk, all right? I'm 22 years old. Most of you niggas in college getting drunk off fucking fucking moonshine. <laughs> like, like, nigga can't drink in the comfort of his own home. Like, most of you niggas are drinking, going outside and harassing people. Get the fuck out. Really, dude? Like, really, bro? And then taking accountability. We fuck with Bruce. I fuck with Bruce. <laughs> Yo, stop! Is. No, I am not. Okay? No, you're fat, I'm not. We don't have the same genes, fat ass. I look at Bruce and see myself. Minus the wood. Okay, we actually, we, we look alike. Weird aftershave shit that he do when he got the big muscle shit. <laughs> you literally, oh, bro. You need to call Kai, you need to apologize, all right? Because there's nothing more manly than a problem. This literally has a neck beard, chat. Look, please look at this picture, please. So no, 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 everybody look at the screen now. Look at it now, look at it now, now, now. Bruce literally. I look at it now. Look at this fucking neck beard. The fuck you mean, yo? This cannot talk about my chin, my neck beard, nothing else, no more, bro. Please stop, bro. I'm a good looking man. We look nothing. I swear, since I grew this goatee, I'm a new. I'm a new nigga now. I have a chin now, y'all. And no, I did not get it from Japan. <laughs> Back to the bed. <laughs> what Yachty do? What? D. I ain't gonna lie, Yachty, you gotta slide, dog. I ain't gonna That's talk about crazy. no porn. It's hella crazy. Okay, listen. First, let's go through the screenshots right quick. I didn't even know what the f this was. Like, what what context was this using? When I first seen this, I was like, "Hey, bro, what's wrong with twenty six year olds?" Is that how y'all think of me since I turned twenty six? Y'all know me and your age is the same age. That's crazy. Y'all gotta understand, bro. Even though I'm twenty six, sometimes I still feel like a kid, bro. I still feel young, bro. Like I don't feel like I'm like. Turning 30 or nothing, bro. I, sometimes I still feel like a kid, bro. Sometimes I want to be childish. Ain't nothing wrong with that. That's cool. Like, what what context was this using? When I first seen this, I was like, God damn. What the, like, 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 maybe, maybe my dog was talking about, like, trolling or such. Like, I don't know why a 26 year old ass like that. Uh, maybe he, I, I was trolling on stream and it was a little jokey joke. I even, I, bro, I hit up the fucking leaking. I was like, send me the fucking context of this fucking shit right now. He sent me the whole screen recording of the conversation, and they kicked his ass out. Like, I seen the video. He, they kicked his ass out. He couldn't get it all. You feel me? So I stopped coping with myself, and I told myself, and he was just talking shit. Is that fact? He was just talking shit. There's no, it wasn't trolling. He was just probably talking shit about me. Yes or no? He was just talking shit. Right? Right. That's that just crazy. is what it is. It's Bruce. I know Bruce. It's not nothing new. He talks shit. Hey man, shout out Rage, boy. That chat going crazy. Hey, hey, look, y'all making me look bad, bro. Like, go ahead, type something, bro. Let's try to keep up with his speed, bro. It's no way. Come on, he outdoing us right now. 
Come on, y'all. Tight. There you go. You could have known this nigga for 30 years. He gonna talk shit. This is what it yeah. is. This is what this nigga do. You feel me? But I was out of town. Yeah. I was in California. I, I was I was I was tight. I was mad. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. But I was busy. I had work to do. So it is what it is. Like it's not new to me. It's Bruce. Bruce talk shit. But I ain't think he'll talk shit on me. Cause I ain't never talked shit on this nigga in my life. Ever. In my life. Ever. But we I know that, bro. Y'all know me and Ray's got into a little conversation. Well, y'all, like I said, um, there was a time where um, your rage, like DDG, you know, had like a problem with your, uh, your rage. Your rage called him up on it. Like, I guess on his, I guess his last stream, which like I said, that's you is recorded or something like that. He only has this recent one here on this account, even though he says he's retired. So like I said, maybe he may think about coming back or he just wanted to do because, you know, like I said, his name was still brought up like DGG was right about boots dropping off and blah, blah, blah. But he also had like a beef, which I think I mentioned like maybe beginning the first video the second uh the second video of this like i said of this saga i want to call it where um he also had you know he had multiple beats he had beats with um two other like uh popular youtube streamers um um uh, um people pretty bro for frail used to be popular. i don't know if he's popular like he used to but i know both of these names um so illuminati but you came back on some spiritual stuff yeah, and he, i guess you know it was like some stuff where um i guess he felt like your rage was agreeing with so illuminati as well and you posed you know like they chose for him but now actually they on good terms because it'll be mentioned later on that like i said your rage they met he seen ddg when you know, he was in california the week before last and even the ddg agrees so we're gonna watch a couple clips about that it was called even agent uh agent zero who was also part of a amp as well his reaction because uh ddg did an analogy that i ain't gonna lie y'all had me confused at, all. <laughs> at the same time like what the hell is this but even then at the end of this call in and up like on good terms but let's listen to a couple of the clips y'all never met this nigga before right and you trying to make these fans look at me you have influence that's what you got to understand your fans are going to say ray said you were wrong right then you're wrong woo, 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 right they come on me saying shit that's what they telling me so now you got all this influence you're making them think i'm wrong that contributes to the hate when you can be unbiased and be like okay, you could have okay. called me they call, look, look, if you thought something was wrong bro if we really talk about some internet shit you could call me and be like bro look that was wrong bro you low-key you shouldn't even said that nigga you know me we met what okay the fuck? let me ask you that let me ask you this question have you ever in your life met so illuminati Never in my life, but I don't. That's not the point of this shit. I don't give listen, a fuck. If I'm yeah, listening yeah, to yeah. I don't care if I met the nigga or not. You hey, never met him. him. Listen, listen, listen to my Why logic. Why you ride for him so listen crazy? To my lo Weird. Listen to my logic. Listen. DDG, you're not using your fucking brain, nigga. No, you're not if using you yours. Say, listen, listen. Stop talking. Look, listen. If you if you're saying something, I'm like, yo, I don't agree with that. I'm not gonna agree with that. So Lunati also did shit and said shit. I didn't. No, I said I don't agree no, with the that. Way you said and then you also said that wording. I didn't agree with. Well, we're, we're, we're I'm talking like, about wording, right? We're talking listen, about wording. Right? Listen, like, listen, 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 and listen. And I was like, yo, did he look? He's speaking facts here to the point where I pulled it at the end of the stream. And they said, yo, you won this argument. We all agree that this, this there was a friends like you won that. Like you had won that at a point, and you crying because you made a point. Listen, that, I mean, because no I made a point because I didn't agree with you. Listen, bro. Listen, are you listen, good? Look, 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 look. Oh, listen, are you listen, good, listen, bro? listen to me. I get you trying to troll. You trying to be tough for the chat, but listen, don't don't come on here. Troll? Yeah, listen, what don't am try I to no, about, listen nigga? to me, nigga. Don't come on here to act all tough like you pressing it, bro. Like stop that. Okay, I see what you Yo, doing, nigga. You was nigga, if you come on here and you talk like a real nigga, you feel me, like. Okay, cool. Okay, you're not listen, talking listen, no bro. facts when I'm no, chatting no, listen, right now. No, if you, you come on here, if you come on here and be like, bro, listen, when he like that, bro, you was wrong. Then we could have had a civil conversation. You get on here yelling, oh, nigga, nigga I I love. what, nigga? Calm your bro, ass. That's bro, that's how I talk. Nigga, I talk Calm animated. That's just how, nigga. Bro, bro, I'm not gonna lie. You, you not, we not even talking about nothing right now. You just fucking chatting. At the okay, end of the day, nigga, hang in up. that moment, in that moment, I said, bro, I don't agree with you. In that in that specific opinion that you had or thing you said, I said, yo, you should not say that shit. Listen, you're getting bro. out of you're upset about that. Listen, nigga, what? No, no, listen, bro. This is what I understand. 
If you never met a nigga and you Yo. see a nigga beefing with a nigga and you do all of this, like if we was in person, bro, and you you would never would have said any of that, bro. If you would have called me or anything, bro, you never would have said, said what? None that of that. you were wrong about yeah. this, yes. that, and the third? Who did But right about Listen, this, that, and the third? Did I diss his brother, though? Yes or no? That thing that you said came off like insensitive. You said what I could I Google say? like a thousand. You said I could Google thousands of dead niggas. I'm like, yo, what are you, what are you, why are you, why are you saying that like that? Nigga, nigga? it's true. Niggas die every I, day. But I don't know. Okay, okay, okay. It's true. It is okay. It's true. But I don't agree with a niggas. Like you're trying to make it seem in that moment. You're trying to make it seem like, yo, I never disrespected your brother. You don't say that, and then you say that in the same sentence. It comes out insensitive, my nigga. So in my opinion, I'm like, yo, he shouldn't have said that, right? Did I diss his brother though? Yes or no? That thing that you said came off like insensitive. You said what I could I Google say? like a thousand. You said I could Google thousands of dead. I'm like, yo, what are you? What are you? What are you? Why are you saying that like that? Nick, ooh, niggas die every I, day. But I don't know. Okay, okay, okay. It's true. It is okay. It's true. But I don't agree with. You're trying to make it seem in that moment. You're trying to make it seem like, yo, I never disrespected your brother. You don't say that, and then you say that in the same sentence. It comes out insensitive. So in my opinion, I'm like, yo, he shouldn't have said that right there. Cause now. Be like, no. yo, we dissing this, brother. You said, I know how the internet said, no. shit. No, I'ma tell you what you said. You said like, this is that. why this is why shouldn't be reacting to shit online, bro. That, that he shouldn't have said that. What the you, fuck? I, you know, like, good you and goddamn, bro. That was a recorded video. You, you would cut. All you, you had to say, you had to say was like. Right, he low key that was disrespectful. He shouldn't even said that shit. Like, like it's the it's the way I you say it. No, literally, no, 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 and you trying to make these fans look at me. You have influence. That's what you got to understand. Your fans are going to say, Ray said you were wrong. Right? They say you're wrong. Woo, woo, woo. Right? They come on me saying shit. That's what they telling me. So now, you got all this influence. You're making them think I'm wrong. That contributes to the hate. When you can be unbiased and be like, you could have okay. called me. You could have called. Look, look. If you thought something was wrong, bro. If we really talk about some internet shit, you could have called me and been like, bro, look. That was wrong, bro. You low key, you shouldn't even said that. Know me? We met. What the okay, fuck? Okay, Let me ask you that. Let me ask you this question: Have you ever in your life met Soluminati? Never in my life, but I don't. That's not the point of this shit. I don't give Listen, a fuck. Man, I... Listen, bro. Put it like this: If I, if if you in a room, right? And I said, and yeah. if you in a room, right, and it's a girl behind you, or it's a female yeah. dog, it's a female dog behind you, right? Walking behind yeah. you, and I say, "Hey, bitch," but I'm talking to the dog. You automatically gonna assume that I'm talking to you, right? Might have been a misunderstanding. Plain and simple. <laughs> did that make? Uh, did that make sense? <laughs> that analogy was dog shit. But it made sense, but that that was that was that was the worst shit I've ever heard in my life. My Listen, bro. That's all. Okay, now do you want to be friends again, bro? We cool, bro. This ain't no, this ain't no. You know what I'm saying? Is we just cool or no, we we cool or we homies? You ain't have my, you ain't have my number when them talking about call rate. Cause you ain't give me your number. All right, bro. We friends, bro. Or do, or do we, or should we box on the next card? Or as we you don't want box. Bro. Alright. I'll be Alright, bro. It's all good. Now <laughs> nah, we good, we good though. We good though. We good though, bro. Alright, bro. It's real calling. I appreciate it. I bet, bro. Alright. See, that's how you handle it, man. Okay, y'all. What I know is that I think he, I think that some of them might have even, you know, was also that I don't um, you know, cut off as well, no longer happen. I don't think so. No, no, no. It's it's on and off, whatever. But I mean, like I said, him and your rage now are on good terms. So let's get back to the video. That's what I like to call it. It's a conversation, bro. And he real for calling me. He never spoke bad about Bruce in his life. For Bruce to speak bad about rage when rage speaks so highly of him? But that's crazy, bro. I ain't gonna lie. We're gonna get into that. We're gonna get into that. Two, this shit. This shit is just delusional, all right? 
It says, after Kanye Sweet announced the trip to the Japan trip, he thought they stole his idea, so he blamed Rage because he was the only person. He told, Bruce, I don't know if you got brain rot or some shit, my nigga. I know every, you think everybody's trying to fucking copy you. Like, like you don't understand. Like, he doesn't believe in coincidences. He doesn't believe in influence. Or shit. Everybody just trying to copy him. Everybody's just watching him to copy his. And no fucking streamer better call me during the stream. I'm not answering the fucking phone, nigga. That's... That's a characteristic of a person that doesn't want anybody else to win but them. They want to keep you under. Like, I know as a as a as a as a pioneer, I believe, I like to believe that I'm a pioneer when it comes to the YouTube space at least. And I've seen plenty of creators quote unquote co copy my videos or how I make my content, bro. It's enough money for everybody. It's enough money in the world for everybody, bro. It's enough money for all of us to eat, bro. We supposed to work together. That's how you make it colossal when we work together. I don't look down on nobody and be like, oh, he copying me. Uh, uh. Or when it comes to music, oh, he stole my flow or he took my beat. Who cares, bro? Like we only here for a short amount of time, bro. Let's all ball. Come on, huh? Listen, the Japan shit was a boys thing, chat. It was a boys thing. It was a thing the boys were supposed to do. Kai was the one always on it. Yo, when are we doing it? 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 To the point where it was like last year in March, April, Kai's like, yo, what's going on? Like, yo, if we ain't gonna do this, I'm gonna just go myself type shit. Kai created his Japan idea. Mm. So really, Bruce stole it. That's crazy. How you gonna get mad at somebody wanting to go to Japan when they gave you the idea to go to Japan? You just stole the idea to go to Japan, went to Japan first, and then got mad when he went to Japan afterwards when he came up with the idea. Wow. Bruce, I'm honestly disappointed in you. That's crazy. And these your real homies in real life. Wow. He invited me, but I'm like, damn, I ain't gonna go. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna go if Bruce can't go. I ain't gonna do that. You know what I'm saying? If Bruce not Kai went first? What? Wow. Who did Bruce go to Japan with? He didn't even go with his main homies. Hey. He said, you know what? I ain't even gonna go with my main homies that put me on. I'm gonna go with these other folks. No disrespect to uh people he went with. Cause I'm cool with them too, but if you came up with the idea with Kai and your rage, how you gonna go with other people? That don't make no sense. Hey, I'm just calling it how it is, y'all. I ain't trying to instigate or nothing. Not gonna, I ain't gonna pull out. I don't want this shit to be weird. I ain't doing it. And then Bruce invited me to Japan, and I couldn't. I had contractual obligations. I had strains to do in asses. I already signed papers. I couldn't go. So I didn't go to no fucking Japan. I don't know what the fuck that screenshot is, bro. I didn't know what the fuck that means, my nigga. But again, I'm not surprised, because let, 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 me, let, me, let, me, let me tell you, me and Bruce. Hey, Rage. You act like a 26 year old. I want you to know that. You don't act no childish, bro. Me and you kind of act alike just a little bit, bro. We're not childish. We're 26, we're up, we're successful, we having fun. This is how it's supposed to be. Any 26 year old that's too serious, they're damn near miserable. They bored, they get no ass. Like 26 year olds are supposed to have fun. We still young. We still in our 20s. We ain't hit 30 yet. Don't let him think just because he's three years younger than you that you childish. Okay? For real. Relationship, right? And I know y'all think this is about to be an evisceration. Y'all want me to like end this nigga, bro? You gotta understand, this was my dog for years, my nigga. You're not some random bitch that I eviscerate on YouTube. You're not no pretty. Fredo ass nigga, I don't give a, I know this nigga for you. I tell this nigga everything.
everything in my life. You understand me? Years. It's the same. It's same in that. It's just dis. It's just sad. It's just like disappointment type shit. You feel me? But listen, let me tell you, me and Bruce relationship, right? So last year was the closest me and Bruce ever been. Like I was telling this nigga everything. How many times I pissed the day? He was telling me everything. Like like. <laughs> Wait. Oh, okay. That's a different type of friendship. I ain't never heard no friendship where you tell you call your homie and say, I just pee. How many times you pee today? I ain't never get I never been close with nobody like that. So that's a different type of friendship. So for you to stake a, a dude that tell you his pee schedule, bro, that's your brother. At that point. You probably snake your mama out at that point. Wow. Where's the loyalty, Bruce? Where's the loyalty, man? Shit going on in his life. We was venting. Like, we used each other to, like, vent and shit. We would talk on the phone. We were just vibing, right? Just chilling. That was my dog. That was my dog. Um. Even when it, I could see where his mind was going. Like, Here's the thing though, y'all don't know Bruce, okay? I know y'all say the money changed him. I miss the old Bruce. I miss the, the old house Bruce. I mean, he's always been like this, nigga. Y'all don't know him. Money doesn't change. Y'all heard this saying, money just amplifies your personality and shit. Money, it, it, he's always been like this. This is nothing new. That's why I wasn't surprised by none of this shit. But at the time, we used to vent to each other about this shit. So when he would tell me about shit or You know what money does? Money, what money does to a person, it makes a person seem, feel like they're more powerful than what they really are. It makes people want to abuse power. Having money is a cool feeling, but if you don't know how to manage it, you don't know how to use the money for good, then it means nothing. It's only so many things you can buy. So only so many cars you can buy. You know, it's only so many houses. If you buy a house that's 5,000 square foot, or if you buy a house that's 30,000 square foot, it's still a house. But if you take your money and you go donate it to a charity, or you buy your mama something, or you, you move your family out the hood, you do this and that, that feels way better. Way better. So money does change people, bro. I ain't gonna lie, like, I feel like it. I feel like the, I don't know Bruce. Obviously, he knows him more, but I feel like him getting that little kick deal after that, bro, he start talking crazy. Correct me if I'm wrong. Even if he did have a little envious in his mind, he kept it in the back of his head at minimum, and he ain't wanna exert it. But he got that money, he like, you know what, I don't need these niggas. I'ma talk whatever I wanna talk. Now look at him. Certain niggas, or what he was feeling, I'll hear him out because at the end of the day chat is about pers perspective and shit I was hearing this perspective and I understood where he's coming from sometimes but obviously sometimes he was fucking tripping so I'll be like yo maybe they did this because this down the third maybe this nigga's not actually copying this down the third and so by the end of the conversation he'd be cool he'd be cool like he'd be he, he not he not he not he not crashing out on fucking screams about niggas and shit he just it's cool it's not boiling over right and everything I'm about to talk about chat talked about i'm not leaking nothing i'm not gonna leak anything he's told me i'm not that type of nigga i ain't no whole ass nigga but a situation happened chat that kind of changed shit what happened in december mm. shit was cool but it was like a month without a boys night type shit you know how we are in stream me and Kai be trolling and shit a month ah you no know you know how i know rage is a loyal person Look at his mic. Look at Rage Mike. Me and you both know that Rage got money, bro. We know I know he got money, bro. Come on. I looked at his I I looked at some of his streams, bro. He got 20, 40,000, 50,000 people in there. He got money. He stayed loyal to that mic. He could have went and got the best mic in the market. He could have went and spent $10,000 on a mic. He said, "You know what?" This mic got me to where I'm at. This mic helped me be your rage. That's probably the same mic he used when he was doing the the um the videos about flight and shit. And in Solo Minati. He stayed loyal to that mic. And now look at him.
Loyalty gets you a long way. Don't fuck with us no more. He Hollywood, you know what I'm saying? He don't fuck with us type shit. Like, uh, uh, uh. you feel me? Abdi made it into a video talking about some DYK over? Right? December of 2022, yes. Not 10 minutes after that's posted, I open my group chat. This has never happened before. We've never gotten to nothing. This nigga is blacking on me. Bruce is shit. Call me all type of laggots, all type of whole ass, all type of idiots, all type of clout shit, all type. I'm like. Nigga trying to talk gangster shit. I'm like, what the fuck? Gangster? Nah. Man. Bruce is not gangster. Let's not get it confused. He's not a gangster. Internet gangster. He's an internet thug. Like, when it comes to internet, he's like that. Internet, he's. Mm, I'm scared of him. Internet, he's thuggest, thuggest you can get. But in real life, no. It's a teddy bear. What the fuck is you talking about? What? Me? 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 The nigga you talk to about everything, the nigga I, I, I understand, like, me. You. I'm like, nah, nah, this nigga bugging. Ain't no way. So I start talking my shit. Like, we start arguing. We start, yeah, 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 yeah. Mid argument, this nigga gets on a burner and starts talking about, like, like what? Like, like, like a bitch would do on her fence on, on, on her live talking to her hoes or some shit. On his fucking burner and shit. Talking about, I'm like, what the? He was on a burner? Whoa. So you telling me he went up, hit the little circle, switched the counts, and start talking crazy? Yeah, that's females' tendencies right there. That's wild. Oh, burner Twitch? That's next level. <laughs> I didn't even know that was a thing. They got burner Twitches? Wow. No, that's next level. That mean you really had to get that off your chest to get to live stream on a burner Twitch. What? Ah, uh, nah, that's wild. Burner Twitch is different. Nah, he's, 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 he's something wrong with that man. He's like that. Oh, fuck. Niggas are clipping it, putting it in my community. I'm telling my mom's delete it. I don't want, he's crashing out, delete it. It's gonna look bad. Like, just, just delete this shit out of the community. <laughs> I don't want that shit to spread. Del Wait, I'm still stuck on that uh, burner Twitch though. So you telling me, bro, you don't want to, you don't want to get none of your followers to see it, bro. You just want to get on that motherfucking event. That's crazy. You too deep in the internet, bro. Like, I think after this, Bruce, you need to go, like, go outside, bro. Because I know you never leave a career, but you need to go outside, bro. And just, like, live real life. Go to the mall and just walk around or something, bro. Like, just go kick it. Like, go to the movies or something. Go hang out with some friends and just understand real life to get on to get on a burner twitch and talk crazy about your homie that's like next level that's like a mental battle right there for real that's crazy i get the twitter i ain't gonna lie like you know what i'm saying burner twitters is normal but burner twitters burner instagrams that's normal you might want to you know what I'm saying? Post some pictures that you don't really want to put on the main page. You might want to tweet something in here and there, blah, blah, But like a burner Twitch is wild, bro. You need to stop. Delete it. And I'm, I'm still thinking about this thing. I'm like, yo, he doesn't want people to know his burner. Just delete it. Then it's going to leak. His burner go, just delete. Just delete all clips. Delete all that shit. So we, we start arguing and shit. We're still arguing. We sending voice memos and shit. Nigga call me laggy. I'm like, yo, what? what is you talk? What is you? Just ask me to delete the video, my nigga. Cause the nigga's worried about Twitter niggas being on his head or some shit. About a troll DYK video or some shit. I'm like, bro, just ask me to delete it and I'll delete it. He didn't even, he just went straight to whole ass lagged ass cloud chase. I'm like, what the fuck? So this is kind of,
I was hearing stuff, bro. Hold on. I thought Bruce was pulling up. I got scared for a second. I'm not gonna play nothing he played, nothing he said. But this is kind of how it ended. This is like the last thing, one of the last things I said. You just gotta chill though, bro. Stop thinking niggas is out to get you some shit. You see shit like yo, Ray's low key getting hate from that shit. Low key, I know. Uh, just if you like, I ain't trying to have them niggas on my dick. That's it. But you get so, uh, yo, chill, nigga. Ain't nobody trying to come for your head. Like, bro, just chill. You feel me? Cause Bruce had like a, Bruce has like a, like he thinks everybody's out to get him or some shit. Some type of like the way his brain works sometimes, and I knew that. That's why I, I talked to him. And I like to see where, where, where he's at with shit. And we'll talk shit out. And I, but like, I don't know, whatever. But we 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 talked it out, everything was cool. But I don't know, naturally, we kinda like hmm. We kinda like like we we kinda stopped calling as much. Yeah. Not intentionally, it's not like, oh, I ain't talking that nigga no more. It just after that situation, we went a few months just kinda. Like backed up a little bit, just a little bit. He wasn't venting on the wall and yeah, shit like that. Already Not bad. until like. Appreciate the raid, man. Around kick time, he's asking me, "Yo, what you doing? You're gonna design the contract, shit like that." And that's when we kind of start talking Shout about a little bit Kai, more shit. Boy. But I don't know during that. Time. Seven thousand viewers. Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like XQC right now, man. Appreciate that raid, man. Uh oh. Uh oh. Here I go. We only got 205,000 subs right now, y'all. We're going for the number one spot. Appreciate y'all. Time he started, obviously he started venting to his fucking mods or some shit, talking to his fucking mods, talking to niggas like, Miss Kiff, my nigga? Like, why the fuck of all people does Miss Kiff know this is how to throw about class and that? Listen. Obviously that nigga went to a bunch of yes man ass nigga to vent, niggas to vent. Fucking mods and shit. Yeah. And that's the thing with Bruce. You gotta see y'all, bro. When I if I ever vent to y'all, my little group chat, y'all know, bro. Y'all tell me the real. Y'all tell me if my music ain't hitting. Y'all tell me if y'all ain't like a snippet. Y'all tell me the real. Sometimes I get mad at y'all, but I appreciate that. I appreciate y'all when y'all keep it real. I want no yes man around me. I knew how to talk to the nigga. I know how to. You gotta tiptoe around Bruce. Cause you gotta watch what you say, cause you don't know. This is exactly what happens. You gotta watch what you say, or his he will start internalizing shit, saying shit a different way. This is not a third, yada yada yada. This is not a third, bro. You just run by a bunch of yes men just sucking your fucking dick. You, you gonna crash the fuck out? They gonna validate all the bullshit you fucking thinking, dumb like fuck. Mods, my nigga, what? So after that. That's when you start seeing shit. He talk, he beefing with, with niggas on strain. Shit's boiling, boiling over. It's not a throw. We are talking a little bit, a little bit, but it just wasn't as often, right? I wrote some shit down because y'all know I'm a yapper. I ain't trying to get off topic and shit. I just want like I just point some some points out and shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and like, but when I had seen this though, chat, I'm like, if he if he's saying shit like this to his mods, and niggas like mischief, who he don't give a fuck about? What the fuck is he saying to like his real homies and shit? Mm. I know he probably talking crazy about the whole D.O. Like, probably when he talked to his, like, uncle and shit, he probably telling his uncle about y'all, like, I'm talking to D.O. right now. He probably talked to his uncle, like, man, I hate how they, I hate how they follow me. I hate how they ride for me. Look at these dumbass niggas posting these TikToks and Twitters, tweets for me for free. They so stupid. If I was y'all, I'd figure out who his uncle is and ask his uncle what he been saying about y'all. Maybe his a hey, Bruce uncle. If you watching this, you need to leak y'all messages, bro. Cause I know I just know he got the real T. This ain't this ain't nothing. This surface level. But whatever he be telling his uncle, bro, that's what it really is. Hey, Do man, look. I ain't gonna lie, bro. This ain't right. And this is a nigga I told everything to like, like. Shit, in my head, he taking to the grave. That's the type of nigga I ain't trusting shit with. Type, you feel me? So what the fuck is he saying to like his homeboys? Or his, or you know, niggas he actually trust and shit. So I ain't gonna lie, bro. I'm still hung up on the why did he diss Lil Yachty? What did Lil Yachty do to Bruce? That's what I'm confused about. 
Bro, you little yachty don't bother nobody. <laughs> but close? I know you lying, bro. I know you're lying. Over a beanie? No, 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 no. Yeah, lying. He beefing with people over Counter Strike and beanies. Come on, Bruce. You ain't got a beef about that. That's crazy. Nah, that's wild. Over clothes that you ain't even make. It ain't even your brand. You ain't make a dollar. You spent money on it. I would never come up to a dude and be like, hey, you stole my swag. Bro, if you go to Balenciaga right now, bro, you can literally copy my... All I wear is like Balenciaga and... I thought this is like a uni unico t is ten dollars man h and mt y'all want to steal my fit have at it i shop at balenciaga if y'all want the same pants as me go to balenciaga bro they probably 1500 i ain't gonna lie they gonna cost you but if y'all want the same little big pants i be wearing go to balenciaga bro they got all of them y'all want the big little shoes i be wearing the, the go to balenciaga they got all of them bro we can all dress alike That's crazy, bro. Over a beanie? And he shot himself in the foot foot. I'm like, damn. So that shit kind of like, you know what I'm saying? But I always gave this nigga the benefit of the doubt because I know he don't do shit. It's like, it's just his head, bro. I'm not gonna lie, it's just his, it's like his head. And Kai said it perfectly yesterday. My dog need therapy, gang. Like, y'all, I know y'all make fun of therapy and all this shit, but now I know roast and shit, my dog need therapy, bro. I don't know what it is. I don't know is like like half a Bruce is like the coolest, most real nigga. Like I just want to be around that nigga. And there's another half sometimes that just, that's just negative, 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 like just negative and shit. Some people it's got like personality disorder. It's like a real thing. Fuck. But I always knew that, and like I accepted that. But like I was like working, I don't know, bro. Like I, I don't even know how to explain. I don't even know. I don't even know how to explain it, my nigga. I just didn't think. I just didn't think I'll see some bullshit on me. Actually, I did. I did think I'll see some bullshit on me. But I was like, the little man, nah, he won't. He won't. He, he ain't gonna say some shit. He ain't gonna say no, no shit about me. But it is what it is. Um, listen, listen, listen. The CSGO shit with Kai. I seen him say, bro, bro, Bruce. CSGO was a boys' night idea. You were gonna play CSGO on stream. So you telling me Kai, your rage, and Bruce all came up with playing Counter Strike Go? And Bruce got mad because Kai played Counter Strike Go? Wow. What? And you talking about him being childish? You talking about rage being 26? And you trying to beef over a game. <laughs> y'all could have just 1v1. Why y'all just 1v1 and say, hey, let's 1v1 and see who better. Why you got a beef in real life about a game? How old are we? Bruce, I don't know if you know, bro, but you a grown ass man, bro. You 23, bro. You grown, bro. You a grown ass man. Like, you not a kid, bro. I think he think in his head that he a kid or something, bro. You're not a kid, bro. You are grown, bro. 23, you're not in school. No, you couldn't even... If you went to college right now, you'd be the oldest one there. That's crazy over Counter-Strike, though. Wow. Not even Call of Duty, though. <laughs> not even no Modern Warfare 3. Quick scope, none of that. Counter strike, bro. You can't even aim down sights on there. Ain't that the game where you only can shoot from the hip? <laughs> bro, come on now. What the hell? Boys fell out. So I went to Kai with the CSGO shit. Cause yeah, I seen a, a, a screenshot about, about CSGO. I went, I'm like, yo, I want a video first time playing CSGO. And I'll never play it again. That's literally what we did. I said, let's play CSGO. We played it and we never played it again. That wasn't Kai copying this nigga, bro. That's not what that was, my boy. That's not what the fuck that was, gang. You feel me? And like, 
and I know he. It's just sad because right before all this shit dropped, chat, I was on the phone with this nigga for the first time in months, and we was talking, and he was telling me rage. I'm not the same person. I've changed. I'm changing. This not a third. This not a third. And I believe him. What he turned into the hawk or something? What you mean? <laughs> Bro, I think Bruce think he like a superhero villain or something. Like, I think he, I think in his head, bro, he think he like, I think Bruce think he like, what you call it? He think he like, um, the Green Goblin or something. <laughs> this is just, bro, the whole beef is just childish to me. I don't know if I'm just old or something, bro, but I know I ain't tripping, bro. We beefing over beanies and video games. That's who we beefing niggas over. Like, bro, you know, there's people really out here getting knocked off, like in real life, getting knocked off over of real beefs. You beefing with your main homies that put you on over a video game and a beanie. Now you finna lose all your juice. I actually believe, like, he's starting to, like, I know, oh, you're just falling for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I, I, I truly believe him because he has. Don't let this nigga tell you nothing, bros. It, you have an ego of death. You have one of the biggest egos on. That's why when you was beefing with DDG and I said, y'all the same people, y'all both have ego. You have an ego. It just is what it is. Accept it. Accept it. But for him to say, like, he's working <laughs> on his flaws and shit, that kind of made me. Ha that's like, yo, that kind of made me happy. Like, he was on the phone. I'm like, damn, my nigga. That's some real nigga shit. A lot of niggas don't have the. They have too much ego to admit that shit. You feel me? So that was a that was like a step in the right direction, and boom, all this happens. I'm like, fuck. And bro, let me tell y'all something, chat. This nigga is good at like, I don't want to call him a manipulator, but he's good at manipulating. You know what I'm saying? Yes, so listen, manipulator. What's probably gonna happen? He probably gonna come on here, blame everything on. They set me up. They put me in a call with DDG, bro. Chat, go shut. The what? Bro, me and, me and Bruce was going back and forth for how long? We was probably going back and forth for like a week, maybe some few days, something like that before that even happened. When they invited me to the call, I'm like, OK, cool. Like, really, realistically, if we speaking real, when it comes to like when I hopped in that call, it's really like damn near three on one versus me. They closer. I don't, they closer with Bruce than they closer with me. So it's like, I'm hopping in there naked. I'm like, ooh, you know what I'm saying? I'm just, I'm trying to talk to him. I'm trying to see if it's really smoke. And he was in there before I even got in there. So how did they bait him into a call? And he was in there first. <laughs> he was in there first. It even got to a point where I was bringing Rage and Kai up during a little back and forth with him and Rage was like, don't bring us up. It was really, he had the advantage. So how like, how you gonna blame him for putting you in the call? Like, I think Bruce is just, I don't know what's going on with Mr. Bruce, man. Maybe him and his girl broke up or something. Like, it gotta be something deeper. See, I'm I'm cool enough to give him the benefit of the doubt. Like, it got to be something wrong with him. Something wrong going on at the crib, bro. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. There's nothing new. This was going on before DDG. This was happening after DDG. Just take accountability. Stop blaming. I see. Listen, that's one thing I don't do. I don't ever bring up girls. I'm just saying hype. I'm giving him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe that's because sometimes when niggas go through it with their girl, bro, they ain't in the right mindset. You feel me? And they might be. And then he be every time I see him on stream, bro, he be drunk. Maybe he got a little alcohol problem. And then he get on there and he just get to talking crazy. Maybe he need to go to rehab for alcohol or something. Something going on. I'm giving him the benefit of the doubt. I'm being nice right now. I'm being fair, unbiased. That's all I'm doing. Blaming people. Stop blaming things. Blame yourself. That is it. That is fucking it, my nigga. Okay, stop it. Stop it. Bruce is really good at making you believe what the fuck he's saying. It could be straight nonsense. A whole lot of nothing. 
but he is very good at making you believe what the fuck he's saying is facts. Facts. The whole chat. He gonna come on stream most like a whole chat be facts. You feel me? <laughs> but I don't. He doesn't do it intense. That's just how his brain works, my nigga. That's just how his brain works on God. It don't don't. He's a. This has nothing to do with no fucking DDG situation, my nigga. I ain't gonna lie. You know who I seen while I was in LA? DDG! It wasn't even on purpose. Me and I, I was chilling with Kalani. We ran into fucking DDG. I said, oh! What the fuck is up? When he looked, it was the day the Bruce shit was going on. We dapped each other up. He looked at me. I looked at him. He's like, yeah, this is true. I seen Rage out. I stepped out. You know, it's my birthday all month. So I'm stepping out. I'm finna go to Dubai and everything for my birthday. I'm turning up. So I step out. It's me, my brother, a few other of my homies. And um, yeah, we just kicking it at the club or whatever. Then I see Ray's in the distance. I ain't know if it was really him though. I'm I'm looking, I'm like, is that Ray at the hill? And then he had like walked around or whatever, and then I see him and I dapped him up. But I promise you, bro, I wouldn't even think about no Bruce situation. I really didn't even really look into it. I just seen people like tagging me and stuff, but I ain't really look into it. That's why I ain't like bring it up or nothing. Like, it don't, I'm telling y'all, bro, I've been in my own world. Like, I don't even be, I don't think about a man named Bruce. <laughs> I don't. Like, believe it or not, bro, I do not care at all. So, I'm not, yeah, so. I dapped him up or whatever. We kicked it. And me and Rage, we damn near kicked it though. The rest, no, not like that. But we, you know what I'm saying? We was vibing. Cool. Like the little conversation we had, bro, that was that's nothing. That's nothing. So y'all always trying to make shit seem like it's on some gay shit, bro. But no, nah, we was vibing. Cool. Cool or not. I feel like people forget, bro. Like, I feel like people don't understand that. But I am like, I know I, I got nice stuff. I know I buy nice things and all this other stuff. But I'm very humble. I'm a cool dude. Like, I'm a regular dude for real. I be kicking it. That's why, that's why I always say, like, if somebody like Bruce or somebody like So Luminati or somebody like, not Fredo, he a weirdo, but like, I look, like if they would have met me in real life, I never met So Luminati to this day. If they would have met me in real life on some real life shit, we would probably be homies. Cause I don't even be on nothing. I be kicking it. I want everybody to win. I be chilling. I chill, bro, all the time. But nah, I seen Rage out. Cool little night. I'm like, hey, we didn't talk about it. We just talked about some other shit, my nigga. He did not. He did not talk about DDG. He did not bring. I mean, he did not talk about Bruce. He didn't bring it up. But like, it was like, if you know, you know. He tried to tell me, I told you so type shit. Like in his eyes, I could see it. And I was just like, <laughs> fuck up my face, nigga. I was just beefing with your ass, nigga. Fuck is he doing? Like, I, was, I was just cussing your ass out on stream, nigga. Fuck. You feel me? But uh, yes, bro. Bruce just needs. To figure some shit out, though. Like, I ain't. If I wasn't Kai, bro, Kai handled yesterday's situation perfectly. Yes or no, chat? Yes or no? He didn't point in my face in real life, right? He just did that on the stream. Yeah, by the way. You know, we, we had a cool, friendly night, bro. Come on up. He did. I, I honestly think Kai handled that shit yesterday better than <laughs> I would. Because this is the only little shit that I see that he talked about me. Just talking about some why I act like that if I'm 26 and, and some shit, some bullshit. But nigga like me? Oh, Lord. Yo. Like, oh my God. I was mad over this little ass shit, but I had two days to like chill out. I had two days or a day, whatever, how long it's been. I had like two days to chill the fuck out. You feel me? But you a drama queen. Suck my dick, nigga. He let he leaked the kick move, bro. I I just had to I just had to accept that that's just who Bruce is, bro. People could change, but that's just who he is. Like it's sad. He's been wanting and Bruce. I know you've been wanting to talk to me. I, I you been call you called me when I was on the plane yesterday. You call you've been wanting to talk to me, and it feels I feel bad. I, why do I feel bad, nigga? Cause I know how much this internet shit fuck. It fucks with my head, and I know how much it fucks with his head. 
and the whole world just nobody got a stronger mental tip for the internet than me bro y'all don't know what i went through these past few months y'all don't know how many commit bro i'm beefing with my girl community bro i didn't beef with five four five communities at one now, GGG right here could be referred to and he's talking about, Haley, you know, his girlfriend, Haley Bailey. How, how, why am I saying Haley? I mean, it's Holly Bailey, Holly Bailey, um, you know, due to, you know, the BS that was, you know, talked about last month. You know, the possibility sitting there, whether she's pregnant or not, and people, you know, got stuff to say like, you know, he ain't ish, you know, she foolish for being him, blah, 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 blah. And maybe they could refer to besides the Little Mermaid shit, but it could be us referring to that too. You know, even though it's none of, they grown, it's none of our business whether she's pregnant or not. Once. Still standing, nigga. What are y'all saying, bro? Like, nobody got a tougher mental than me, bro. Nobody got a tougher mental than me, bro. The average nigga would have been crashed out. But some people ain't got it like that. Like, I honestly, I don't know how Bruce gonna get through it. For real, like, I want a one. I can handle it. But some people can't separate the internet from real life. Is against him right now, and like niggas on his ass, niggas is trying to cancel him all this shit. And I know it's fucking. I feel bad. Why the fuck do I feel bad for this nigga right now? When it's his fault. Like I, I'm sitting there like, damn. He probably sitting there like dead ass. Probably like, you don't know what the fuck to do. Why the fuck am I still thinking about his? You know what I feel like, bro. I feel like Bruce ain't standing no bending, nigga. Bruce ain't standing on bending. That's all I'm hearing from it. Nigga ain't standing on business, man. Benefit! Nigga ain't standing like, fuck! On business, man. But, again, I know y'all wanted me to visit. I don't hate the nigga. I don't. I, I don't. I, I know y'all are on Twitter. This is gonna be the best fucking. He's gonna end this. I don't wanna do that, my nigga. I don't. I genuinely want Bruce. To be his peak self and it's that self without that negative shit that comes across uh, his peak over with rather y'all <laughs> whether you want to believe it or not rage and kai bro yeah i didn't end the dog bro he's done i it's it's he got he probably got 10 hp left the circle is closing he ain't got no more mats he got no more wood, no more brick, no more metal. And the dude that he fighting got a rocket launcher. <laughs> it's probably over for dog, bro. Yeah. Yeah, I did it to him, bro. But it he deserved it though. He deserved it though. I ain't gonna lie. He deserved it, bro. It's about it about that time, bro. Karma. Hey, karma spin. We gonna see if you can prevail like I did, Bruce. We gonna see, bro. It's, it gets tough on that net. It's gonna get spooky, man. Bro, this isn't the first time. You know how many friends? You know how many <laughs> niggas? One time. <laughs> first of all, you other streaming niggas watching this shit, tighten the fuck up too, cause that nigga's not the only nigga like that, my nigga. These streaming niggas are weird. None of these niggas are friends. They do all this shit for the fucking internet, my nigga. All of it. I be talking to them like, damn, oh. these niggas talk shit about these niggas like that. Yeah, they on, they online like that. Somebody they said they got hella sticky bombs, nigga. He got, he got, <laughs> he got 10 HP with a common, with a common SMG, bro. With, and he going against a nigga with sticky bombs, a rocket launcher, and a gold AR, bro. What maxed out max with the unlimited sign on it? Ain't no number on it. Maxed out. He got 10 HP and he on the ground and he got high ground. It's over, boy. It's done. It's gonna take a miracle. Now he can spin around, he can go back in the storm, lose 5 HP, go grab a little gun and make it happen. Or he's gonna hit, hit, hit with that rocket launcher, but you know what I'm saying? All these niggas is fake! Fake! And shout out to my fucking boy Max. Cause even Max, before I knew Max, I just heard his name in like the streaming worlds. And niggas would be like, yeah, nah, he tried to be like, yeah. 
Yeah, he copied. Yeah, yeah. Nah, that nigga copied. Yeah. <laughs> so like, my first impression of Max, without knowing who he was, was like, oh shit, niggas I fuck with. Loki talking like they they say that Max niggas. You know what I'm saying? But then I really met this nigga this year. I'm like, this is one of the realest niggas I met on this internet shit. He's his own person. This is one of the realest niggas I met on this shit. And niggas was trying to gatekeep that nigga away from. Like, what the fuck? Yo, these streaming niggas are weird. As soon as niggas blow up like Kai or coming up like Max, niggas try to like push him away. It's like, you niggas is. Ooh, I'm like, ooh. You niggas is lame, nigga. Lame as fuck, nigga. God damn, bruh. And listen, bruh. I ain't about to, I ain't about to go in too much, bro. I, I look look, Bruce. I I also didn't call you before this stream, cause I know how it would go. We'd be on the phone, and Bruce is so good with his words, chat. Like I I I know I wouldn't say my my my, my real thoughts and how I want to feel and what I want to say on this stream, my nigga. I'd be nerfed. Mm -hmm. Tell me, be thinking how this nigga feeling, shit. You know what I'm saying? So you probably mad as fuck that I ain't call you before this, but it is what it is. It is what it is. And don't flip this around. You just come on this bitch on your next stream and just, I fucked up. That, there's nothing else you can say. See? I fucked up. See, he ain't gonna say it because then he gonna look like the little homie. If he get on here and say it. Okay, let me ask y'all this. Chat. If Bruce get on here and apologize, does that save him? Is that like putting a bandage on? Not a full med kit. That's like putting two bandages on. So he, he will he get back to 50 HP? Or would it not work? See? Y'all saying nah. See, people just not rocking with him. It is what it is, bro. It happens. It happens, bro. One thing you can't do when you when you going through this internet wars and stuff, you can never beef with your own community. Them the people that's gonna rock with you forever. That's it. I got some shit I gotta fix. That's it. Chat. When you notice a pattern with people, it's not a coincidence, my nigga. Like there's people in my life with the same shit. Patterns always follow them. They follow with people all the time over the same shit. Why? Not everybody's out to get you, my nigga. It's you. It's you. That's it. I don't hate nobody for it, but you gotta handle your shit. I have too much shit going on up chat. I have too much shit going on in my life, bro. Chat to be worried about a fucking grown ass man pillow talking to about me with his fucking mods, nigga. Jesus Christ. I have a fucking Nike sponsorship ad to post right now. I'm gonna my fucking burp, drop them off, nigga. W Flex. I see how you threw that in there. That's respect. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, man. I see. D, he went off like that. He ended the clip like that with a flex. I ain't gonna lie. Y'all killed dog, man. Look. It might be over. You ended the stream with a Nike ad? Nah, you different. I hate to tell y'all, bro, like, and I don't, bro, whether Bruce be, becomes a billionaire, whether Bruce survived this hate train or whatever, that don't change my pockets, no way, shape, or form. I don't care what happens. I'm just on here to get my two cents, bro, because I feel like I'm involved in it, obviously. Apparently, I'm the whole reason for this. Since he beefed with me, he start crashing out about his homies. Don't make no sense. But, somebody told me to lick my lips, but I ain't really need to, but. Yeah, y'all, this is my one last stream. I had a lot of fun, I ain't gonna lie. I wish I could stream again, but. I just don't feel comfortable being on here every day and then I end up getting back into it and then y'all start to not like me again. So I appreciate y'all for switching back on me and starting to like me again. Appreciate it, y'all. Apparently y'all forgot I'm a cool nigga, but it's cool. I forgive you. I forgive you forever. I still love you. 
Y'all still funny like I remember. I had a lot of fun on this stream. I'm about to take my girl out to dinner. Have a good time. I'm going to London tomorrow. Any of y'all stay in London? I might, you know, I might. Last time I went to London, I put some shoes around the city. I might do that again. Give away some more clothes, shoes or something. And I might go somewhere else. Something like that. Um, but. Go ahead in the stream, y'all. Appreciate y'all tuning in, man. I want to say this, though. I hope that this is nothing more than a setback for Bruce. A little nerf in the views or whatever you want to call it. But I hope it doesn't go as far as the mental battle where he feels as if the world hates him and he wants to do something to himself. God forbid, I'm just saying, I'm just throwing it out there. Bruce, you're still a, you're still a successful young black man and you still uh, have the chance to redeem yourself. You're still a millionaire. When you cut your phone off, none of this matters. The only thing you need to worry about repairing is your friendship with these folks that had good intentions with you. That's all I say. I say my peace. I don't want no smoke. I don't want no beef with nobody. I'm in my own lane doing my own thing. You don't like my music, you ain't got to listen to it. You don't like my videos, you ain't got to watch it. All I ask is y'all respect me from now on, okay? Hugs and love, y'all. See y'all in the next vid. It might not be this long, of course, but take care, y'all. Thank mm -hmm. you.